One of the tools that I use to monitor smart contract is a website called tenderly.io. So I want to show you some useful features that are available in Tenderly. In this video, I'll show you how to monitor a smart contract and get a notification when a transaction fails. The first thing that you'll have to do is sign up to this website, tenderly.co. Once you're signed up and logged in, you'll see a dashboard that looks like this. To monitor a smart contract, the first thing that we'll have to do is register the smart contract. And to do that, we'll click on the Contracts tab and then click Add Contracts. We have several options here, but for this example, I've already deployed a smart contract on the Robston test network and the contract has been verified. So we'll select on the Import Verify tab and then we'll paste the address of the contract inside here. Inside Remix, I've created a test contract just to test out Tenderly. It's deployed on the Robston test network at this address, so I'm going to copy the address. And then back inside Tenderly, I'm going to paste the address in here. And then click on the contract, scroll down, and then click Import Contracts. Now Tenderly is watching this contract. So if you click on the Transactions tab, you can see here that Tenderly lists all of the transactions from our test contract. So whenever a transaction is submitted to this contract at this address, you'll see the transaction also displayed on here. Once the contract is registered, we can now set up an alert. For this example, I'm gonna set up an alert so that if there's a transaction that fails, then it will send me an email. And to do that, I'm gonna click on the alerting tab and then click on set up alert. I'm gonna scroll down. And for this example, we'll set up alert for a failed transaction. So I'm gonna click here and then I'm gonna select the contract and then select the contract, and then I'm gonna scroll down and then select on destinations. For the destination, I'll send the alert to my personal email, so I'll select this and then hit save. Once the alert is set up, you can see a list of alerts by clicking on the alerting tab. So we set up an alert to send an email to my personal email if a transaction to my contract test tenderly fails. So let's give this a try. Back inside Remix, the contract that I deployed test tenderly has a function called test error. When I send a transaction to this function, it's going to fail. So this will trigger an alert on tenderly and send an email to my personal account. So let's give it a try. The contract is already deployed, so I'm just gonna click on the contract, scroll down, and then we'll click on the function test error. Now Remix is going to give me a warning, but we know that we're testing a function that's going to fail. So we'll just send the transaction anyways. Confirm on MetaMask and wait for the transaction to be mined. Once the transaction is mined, go ahead and click on the Transactions tab. And inside the list of transactions, you'll see that our transaction went through over here. Inside my email, I received an alert from Tenderly that the transaction failed. And it looks something like this. So that is how you use Tenderly to monitor your smart contracts and send notifications. Over the next few videos, I'll show you how to run a simulation on the mainnet using Tenderly and also how to debug a transaction. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching. See you later.